let me show you how to create this code effect you're gonna love it watch the end and make sure you're following this whole timeline that is the first step to make this stop motion animation easily now that you have your scene you want to increase it a bit depending on how long you want it to run for so now the next one you want to do is to click on overlay so you click out click on overlay and this is where you want to bring in the moving car and i'm going to show you the simple car you're going to be using to get this effect right this is car click hd and add to timeline so now you can see our car is in 3d green screen so now we want to get out the color so you're going to scroll down clicking on that car and then cut out and you want to click on chroma key and then you want to select the green click on intensity and increase intensity now we have the green out at 14 intensity we're going to click on ok and now we have the car next step you want to do is to first move the car to where you want it to be either on that lane which is good and we can just move it a bit out of frame like that so we still have the car while at the beginning of the frame you want to go over and click on the first arrow let me just underline that so that you see it for yourself this is where we want to click it's keyframe right so we want to click on keyframe and then we want to go back click first keyframe and then we want to scroll to the end of that clip for instance this is where the end is right we want to drag our car down this road okay and out of the screen just like that so you want, might want to take it totally out of the screen like that and now you can see we've created two keyframe and if we go back to the beginning this is what we we'll get so you see it's easy and all you have to do is just to trim the first clip now since we have it that length and we are okay with that length we'll just trim the first clip just too much like so right one more thing we want to do is to go to graph we want to find graph scroll down where you find graph and then you want to add an easing effect just to make the graph smooth okay so you have that effect now and it makes the graph smooth and now all you need to do next okay all you need to do next is to export it i'm going to be showing you how to make sure how to make sure you add sound effect that makes it stand out in the next video if that's something you want to see make sure you like share and follow so now just hit on export and it's going to export your scene and that's how you have it